Hello, this is Kane with Bull Ridge Plumbing here at 1006 uh, Cottonwood Drive, doing a dirty movie on the roof. We came here to do a sewer clear and reinspect. Um, surprisingly enough, we did not get to the city tap, and we are at the end of our rope at 143 foot, well, almost 144 foot. Um, go ahead and start pulling back. This is a clay line. We do got a little root guy here hanging on the side of the wall. Um, we ran the largest bit we had and it just didn't really get it very well. So, But we are doing root X today so there's not a big deal to worry about that. Here we enter in a belly about 138 foot. Um, I think we're probably looking at maybe an inch and a half of water, maybe two inches of water here. And we come out of that belly at about 131. Uh, for the most part, this line looks pretty good. <laughs> we did have a couple of root intrusions here and there. <clears throat> um, this particular spot at 126 is really concerning. It looks like we have a missing piece of pipe here. You can see the gasket to the other pipe, and then there's just this open spot here. We kind of struggled to even get across that valley, but somehow we're able to get across it. Um, Again, maybe we want, might want to have that located and repaired at a later date. <clears throat> um, wasn't really a whole lot of sludge. Looks like we transitioned at 121 to uh, SDR. We got some stress cracks <clears throat> on the bottom of the line there, but that's that typically happens when they refill on these pipes and puts a lot of weight from above. Not a whole lot to talk about on this line. <clears throat> we'll say this is one of the first lines. I've got to use the max of this cable on and still didn't make it to the tap. Hmm. That spot's weird because I know we ran our machine past it and it doesn't seem like it did anything right there. Maybe that's like a little break on it. Got a little uh, treasure right there. We are going to administer some Redex today. What that is, it's a foaming herbicide, two part compound that will fill up this entire pipe, top to bottom, front to back, and kill the rest of these <coughs> little roots you're seeing here and there. Looks like we did transition to cast iron probably about five or six feet ago. I 
This cast iron looks pretty good. You, it's not very bumpy. It's not very scaly. So good condition. Thunderstorm. And it looks like we're coming up our vertical ascent right now. Again, this was accessed on the roof through a three inch vent stack here. the vent stack right there. This is the back side of the house. Thank you for watching.